What is going on YouTube and welcome back to another video. I officially hit Unreal in Fortnite Reload Ranked. So in this video, I'll be showing you guys exactly how I did that by giving you guys tips and tricks while breaking down my gameplay. This will be my last two games before I hit Unreal and I gotta be honest, the second game is absolutely crazy. So make sure to stick around to the end so you don't miss out on anything. Also, if this video gets 100 likes, I will be doing another V-Bucks giveaway on my channel. So make sure to smash that like button and subscribe and comment down below what rank you are right now. Also guys, Four Nightmares just dropped. There's a lot of cool skins in the item shop and a lot more coming soon. So if you guys wanna use code Chubbs Gaming in the Fortnite item shop, it would really help me out and I'd really appreciate it. But without further ado, let's get into game one. Okay guys, so we always decide to land at Pleasant or Snobby because they are our favorites and usually people land here so we get some easy off spawn kills. We fought some people at the beginning but those fights were pretty lame. So let's cut to where things get interesting and I pick up a Mammoth Pistol. If you guys are not rocking the Mammoth Pistol in Reload Ranked, you are asking to lose. It is by far the best weapon in the game because of how quickly you can do a ton of damage and my aim was crazy which helped us get to Unreal. Let's go, 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 go. Most people, I think. We're just better. I have no whites. So I knock that guy, knock that guy. Yeah. I heal. Full elim. Oh shoot, I saw that. Headshot one. Okay, do you see the other one? No, he's to the right. Inside there. Or is that the guy that you headshot? I headshot that guy. His partner's to the right somewhere. They're going for the... I headshot him in the air, dude. Let's go. There's, there's two teams over there. Let's push it. They just get that way. Yeah, that's, that's the guy's partner. Headshot him, 130. Reboots are about to get disabled and this is where things really pick up for us. We see this big hill outside of Tilted and decide we need to be there for the best positioning, but we know there is a team there. This is no problem for us and we decide to push them to claim the hill as our own. Being more aggressive in games leads to more kills, which leads to ranking up faster. If a team sees you being confident, they will most likely run away as you will see these guys do. Just practice being more aggressive in unranked games and then apply it to your ranked ones and I promise you, you will see a difference. Don't be scared to push people and take fights, but be smart with it. We need to get up on this hill. We can we can crouch around and claim yeah, it. We should just move. We'll just move this way. Just stay along the zone. I mean, we got the bunkers to claim it. People are okay. Getting sniped. Getting sniped. Playing the bunk. Oh, they got a bigger bunk. Ninety-one hole. Where are they? Ninety-four. He's still weak, he's still weak. <laughs> yeah, dude, let's go. <laughs> Sir Dominance. Uh, there's a thing down there. Another one to our left as well. A grapple, dude. I'm gonna go down there and get a refresh. They're sniping at us from somewhere. Do you know from where? Can you see? Probably from. Oh, I, no, yeah, I see him. Headshot him. 77. No, it's not. There's no bullet drop off. It's his scan. Dude, I want to open that other drop. How many more bunkers do you have? I don't have any. Oh. Using the bush in the bunker like this allows me to stand here without the enemy knowing where I am, and I'm able to just be patient and wait for a headshot when he peeks. 94. No, I didn't. Headshot him. Knocked him. Knocked him. 82 on his partner. I'm weak. I'm weak, dude. I hit that guy 141 up top. Okay, I'm healing. 
Dude, we just... are so freaking good. Where'd that big pot go? People, people, people. He had a medkit, I'm going for it. Do you have a bunker or something? Oh, oh yeah, I do, I do. <laughs> I can't grab it, dude. That sucks. Oh wait, there's some stuff right here. 165 on it. What the frick? What the frick, bro? It... Did he... That was some sussy aim, I'm gonna be honest. Oh, dang it. Should he use a shock? Dude, that was some sussy aim, I'm gonna be honest. Unfortunately, my duo went down and I was not able to clutch the 1v2 here. I should have used the shocks versus just running out in the open like a headless chicken waiting to be shot, but that got me to 94%, so let's check out game number two. We had a good first game, but game number two is even crazier, so let's cut straight into the action for this one. Oh, oh, wait, over here, Jeremiah, over here. He's getting, he's being chased. Someone gliding in. I'm running out of bullets. His partners, I think, is somewhere over here. Oh wait, up ahead, up ahead. Just over the hill, on the by that tree. Dude, they're both right here. Both down on me. Why am I missing my shots? I got him, I got him. You got his partner? Why am I flicking my aim at the last second, bro? Wait, you got him again? No, 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 no. I hit him for 90. So you hit him. And then I hit his other partner while he was using the grapple too. Coming Knock up by you. I'm pushing over there, dude. That's footsteps on me. Wait, where are you going, dude? We are not together. Hold on. Unreal team, by the way. What a bunch of bots. <gasps> I'm dead. I'm dead. But I'm actually dead. What the frick? I need you to reboot. Dude, I was not with you, dude. No, no. It, I killed that team. It was another team from the distance that just killed me. Just chill. Just chill real quick. Because there's a lot of teams around you. It's not just them. I don't know where to land either. Like, I might have to land over here. Right, bro. Okay, man. Headshot that guy. Hit him for like 150. Knocked him. <laughs> I don't know if we're looking at the same people. Right here. Oh, this that's guy what I was looking not... at. Yeah, that's what I was looking at. I'm oh, pushing his loot. Does he have heavy bullets? Yeah. Oops. Oops. Okay. Behind us? Right here. I don't know where I'm getting shot from. Neither do I. Getting yeah, my He cracked in the sky. Knocked him. Oh, I'm cheating. Up here, up here. Where? Footsteps, footsteps. The guy right in this bush. I'm trying to sneak into the tree. 58, 58. I'm gonna try to break the tree out of the bush. He's right here. 
it's at 64. So. Hold on, there's people. It's, oh, that wasn't me. That was someone else that killed him as soon as I shot him. Do you have AR bullets? That guy's gonna die. 24 hours. I'm gonna go grab, I'm gonna go grab his stuff. Okay. Wait, be careful, Adrian. He got shot up in the cabin. Fine, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Another thing, dude. I can go grab, put a bunker down on that. So we are looking pretty good for this end game, but I need to pause here and explain what's about to happen and what went through my head. So my duo and I see another crate and we want to go for it as soon as we do my partner gets headshot and keep in mind reboots are disabled. I have to make the decision to res him right there and risk whoever headshot him pushing us or I can try and take the guy out and res after. I decide to just fight him and this is where the mammoth really comes in handy because you will see me hit him once for over 90 which gives me the advantage in this fight and allows me to save my teammate rather than throwing this game. Playing aggressive leads to more kills and higher rank. Just remember that. No, I got a shield bubble. Okay. There was shield bubble on this I just got sniped. From in front of us. Shield bubble on me. Nice, dude. Watch out for that other team. Place that shield bubble. Dude, you're so lucky I just killed that guy. I'm going back. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna push back down because I suck. Headshot someone? I don't see where. I'm getting to the loot lake house. Okay. I'm getting on top. Behind the tree, behind the tree. One guy left, one guy. Here's a sniper, here's a sniper. Oh, oh, that's the guy, dude. I almost killed him. Let's drop down a little bit. He's gonna push up. Wait, don't dump me, don't dump me. He's right down there. He's trying to get in the zone. Oops, I just screwed you. I got one. Uh, he's down below. He's down below. I'm gonna. Okay. I'm gonna shock us. 32, 32. He's in the water. Nice. Let's go. I just hit Unreal. Easy. Dude, that was an insane game. How many kills did we have? We only had eight kills. I felt like we had more than that. Let's go! 18,000, dude. I hope this video helps to get you guys to hit Unreal just like me. Thank you so much for watching. And if you want to see me hit Unreal in regular Battle Royale, click right here and have a good day.